sitting next to my dishwasher like we all do on a regular basis. And this time of year, whenever you're having company, it seems that you have lots of helpful guests and they want to stack it for you. And you come back to the old thing, do you rinse or do you not rinse? I sort of rinse, I rinse certain things and I make sure there's no chunks in my dishwasher but I'll leave a little bit of gravy or something on the side. A nice feature that most dishwashers have is that if you stack it after dinner, you can run just the rinse only function if there's a little bit of food on the plates or a little bit of residue and at least buys you time so you don't have to go through and do a really thorough job or run it during dessert. But what happens is I know people who don't rinse at all and they eventually down in the bottom here I'll have standing water and one of the ways I start looking at that is I'll start having more residue or pieces of food that get up on my glassware and what it is is you've got to pull the drain filter out and you just pull out the screen and run that under the faucet so you might have like a bit like I don't know what that is it's fine when it's your own family's stuff and clean that all out Put it back together after you've rinsed it under the faucet and you're good to go again. If you think that part of your dishwasher isn't cleaning very well, the little holes that the water shoots out of often can get clogged with different things. So again, you can release that or just you know use a toothpick and get them out on their own. And then stack as usual and you're good to go again. And there's my helpful hint. <laughs>